What's up everybody? Good morning on this beautiful, beautiful Thursday morning. It is insanely nice out there. Ah, just ran what I think should be another 10K. My thing actually tells me what I run. I just zone it out while my music's playing. I'll catch it every couple kilometers, but uh, should be over 10K I think again this morning, which will be my second one in a week, I believe. I think I ran my other one on Saturday, maybe? Friday or Saturday, something like that. So just inside a week, I think, two 10Ks for me. Plus I ran the other days as well. Not, not 10Ks obviously, but, but a good distance. Uh, I'm really loving this, you know? I said how much I was, was missing the gym and stuff before, which, which I still am, kinda. But this running outside is uh, super fun. Like. I'm, I've said before that I probably wasn't still going to do it after the gyms open back up. I'm totally still going to do it after the gyms open back up. Um, while it's nice out, um, in the winter I'll probably run at the gym on the days clearly where it's like ice and snow and all that stuff. But I don't mind the cold. I mean, it definitely ain't warm right now. It might look nice, but uh, it's pretty cold. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, so... <laughs> So yeah, I'm definitely loving all this running that I'm doing. Uh, it feels great. Like I really, uh, oh my God, it's sore. But it feels tremendous. I don't really have much else to say. Just kind of rambling right now. Woo. So yeah, so I've gotten a bunch of messages from people telling me uh, that I've inspired them to start running again. And that's amazing. Like, I love getting those types of messages. I help a lot of people out with like fitness and nutrition and all that jazz, but uh, I've never really done anything that extreme for cardio before, except for when I was doing the uh, mixed martial arts show. Uh, my cardio was insane then. Uh, best it's ever been. I plan to beat it, even though that was like seven years ago or something, six years, eight years ago. I don't remember. Um, yeah, so I got a bunch of messages from people. Some people I know, some people I don't know. Just just off the internet. That's the cool thing about social media. People can reach out and send you some nice positive messages. And I love hearing that stuff. Like, it's it makes everything you do worth it. If you can inspire one person to do something, to make their life better, to, to get healthier, or whatever the case may be, um, pushing yourself to the limit every day is worth it to help that one person, in my opinion. Maybe you think otherwise, I, I don't know. But that's, I love hearing that stuff. Um, that pushes me to train harder. Hearing that you're motivated by me motivates me like you wouldn't believe. I, I, I love it. Um, so yeah, so thanks. If there's anybody else doing that, let me know. Or if you're not comfortable with that, that's cool too. Just keep doing what you're doing. Um, go out there every day. You don't need to run. You can walk. You can do anything. Just just get outside. And if you have a bike, ride a bike. If you want to go for a walk, go for a walk. If you run, run. Get outside. Enjoy the fresh air. Uh, especially now, it's uh, getting to be a really nice spring. I say that. And yesterday we had like hail and snow and it's like the middle of May. But <laughs> um, where I am, there's right now there's a lot of beautiful animals. There's a family of ospreys. I would put them on camera, but they're kind of far away and it wouldn't zoom in. Um, they've been on top of this telephone pole for years, ever since I've lived here. I don't know how long they've been there before that. I've lived where I am now for almost two years and they've been up there ever since. And we've had hurricanes and tornadoes and insane ice storms and this nest has not moved. This nest is built better than most houses or all houses, I'm sure. But yeah, so they have babies every year and they're so cute. Uh, one of them's staring at me right now. They're very protective over their nest. Huh. But yeah, I see animals all the time. I see bunny rabbits, deer, uh, squirrels, chipmunks, whatever, o osprey up there. Um, all kinds of cool, cool creatures. A pheasant. I saw Philip this morning. I, I, <laughs> I used to live in a place that had a family of pheasants before I moved here. And that's the thing I miss most from my old house is my family of pheasants. And as soon as I walked out my front door this morning, the pheasant went made their pheasant noise and uh, I'm positive my pheasant has found me. Well guys, like you 
like to thank you for listening to me rant here this morning on my run. Just cooling down right now. Gonna go inside and stretch. And uh, yeah, that's it. There's a bunch of people coming out to ride their bikes on the path I'm sitting on. So <laughs> I'll see you soon. Thanks.